grandmother went to Auschwitz, went taken in a cattle car with her mother, father, brothers, sisters, nephews, nieces in 1944. And her family, almost without exception, the day they arrived, the day they arrived, went straight to the gas chambers. Didn't take long. Straight. You got off. I don't want to go through all the things that happened. Undressed completely and straight to the gas chambers. The crime they committed was that they were Jews, period. Nothing else mattered. To watch today the betrayal of the one democracy in the Middle East there's no question about that. There's only one democracy. There's only one country in the Middle East where people, whatever your background is, whoever you are, it is a freaking democracy. That we are watching in front of our own eyes the betrayal of Biden, of the people, of the state of Israel. That's what we're watching right now. We're watching members of Congress. It's not just that Trump must win the presidency. There's no choice. There is no choice. And by the way, you know, I'm going to be out there doing everything in the world. And I will say to people out there, look, you may have your issue with Trump. You may not like a particular phrase or comment. That's fine. But there is no choice but to vote for Donald Trump. If you care about America. 